What's up everyone? It's been a while since I've done a review on my car, but done quite a few different changes to it. I'm actually out camping here at Valley of Fire State Park in Nevada. But um, last time I did a review on my car, it was about the lift kit that I did on it, the Primitive Racing. And uh, recently I just added the Yokohama Geolander all-terrain tires. <coughs> and they're quite a bit more uh, uh, more meat on these tires because <coughs> I put those uh, stock ones to the max already and popped them already now and throw these bad boys on and they're really nice they uh, do some damage because I didn't downsize the rim but I don't really care <laughs> to be honest with you uh, this is my bike also we just did a about 200 mile bike ride on the desert I mean, literally on the crazy freaking heat, and it was a quite a bit of a nightmare. I can't say nightmare; it was a lot of fun. We made it through; we didn't fall. Um, and by we, I mean I did. Uh, I rode my uh, wife on the back of this thing on dirt and sand and everything, and somehow we pulled through. <laughs> I don't know how we did it? We did about a good 100 miles in in on dirt with it. So but it's a XR 650L. Did quite a few mods to that thing too, but anyways, I just wanted to do another review. I also put, um, well, this is a big review right here. Is I did a uh, Tapui roof tent. I got the rain fly off because it's about 96 degrees out right now and it's really hot. So, took the rain fly off. But this thing is awesome though, it's super comfortable. Fits up there perfect. Me and my wife fit up there just fine with extra room for all our gear. It's the sky, I think, or something like that. But this thing works great. Pretty sure you guys have all seen what the inside looks like, but got a ton of room. It's really hot in here, but a ton of room. And uh I've camped this thing a few times already, and it's been super windy every single time. So this thing in wind is, I mean, perfect. It, the zippers make a lot of noise, but other than that, I mean, this thing literally works amazing. I can't even believe how good this thing works in the wind so far, and I haven't done the rain yet, but that's something else that I do want to try doing. <laughs> well, anyways, that's all I got. I just want to do a quick update uh, with my new tires on it and I know my camping stuff's all over the place but that's my car and the suspension kit has been doing amazing for me it's actually helped out a lot in a lot of different situations I mean I've gone over rocks I mean I can't even tell you the trails that have gone on I've just burnt the clutch out in it too not too long ago got stuck on the incline and uh, just <laughs> I want to say it just not as uh, experienced off-road driving a manual transmission. This is my first off-road, off-road vehicle that I've driven with. Uh, that's a, that's a manual, so it is a little different experience for me, especially being stuck on a hill. And uh, I wish I had video footage of that because it was probably the craziest thing I've taken this thing on. And uh, yeah, I got to get towed out of the desert. It was about a, very far. Luckily I got friends with really big trucks that were able to help me out and tow me back home so I didn't have to uh, pay a whole bunch on uh, towing chargers but that's my car. Um, just want to do a quick update again. She's got probably about 26 grand in it now. 26,000 uh, miles on it so but that's all I got for you guys. That's all. Later.